Oh, this is Stephen. Uh, we're going to be talking about the Coleman Extreme 150 quart cooler. We'll be doing some mods to this. This is going to be video number one. Um, first of all, uh, I like to say it's a very good made, strong, heavy cooler. Um, let's try to get this open. Oh, it. Um, held the ice in there good for like uh, this is second day there's a little bit of water it's keeping my cronus cold um, I'm gonna be doing mods to this cooler um, first of all opening the cooler is very hard it has these notches up here that once it shuts it very hard to open uh, I'll be grinding those off uh, you have this plastic uh, tension uh, safety strap that's going to be removed uh, replaced with a, a stainless steel cable back of the cooler uh, you got these plastic hinges that once they're taken off they'll be thrown immediately in the trash um, I don't understand why Coleman even puts these on their products because it's, it's just ridiculous uh, once the I do grind down the, the two parts that hold it shut. I'll be adding some um, latches here and then a latch here also. Then I'll be using explosion rivets where, uh, if you don't know what that is, that's a rivet that if you cannot put a washer on, you'd want an exploding rivet. Uh, like I said, it's a very good cooler. This is part one. Once you guys come back and see part two, let me get the mods done to this cooler. Uh, this cooler is like $80 on Amazon. Um, I think Walmart might sell it for around $70. Uh, maybe have another $80 in other parts I'm going to be putting on it. But I want you guys to stay tuned. I'll come back and see this because this cooler is going to turn into a very bear proof cooler for under $200. Uh, so give me a week. Stay tuned. I appreciate you watching.